why do I do this? One of the most common questions that I get, particularly from other trainers, is why do I make so many free tutorials or give away my training secrets? I've even taken flack from some force-free trainers that believe that creating free YouTube tutorials cheapens this industry. An easy answer to the question of why do I do this is that I believe seeing is believing and I want to show that force-free works even for so-called difficult dogs. However, there's also a more personal reason. My life is comfortable now, but it wasn't always this way. I grew up without much money and things were not easy. At one point in my 20s, things got so financially rough that at the grocery store that week, I had to choose between my dog's kibble and my dinners. I do believe that dog trainers are skilled, educated, and valuable. I in no way want to undervalue the work that we do. I believe that we deserve the private rates that we charge because this industry and the work is not easy. I also think that there are certain dogs and certain concerns that may need one-on-one -on -one help and a highly individualized approach. However, I also recognize that not everybody can afford private dog training rates. For most of my life, despite how much I love my dogs, I personally wouldn't have been able to afford the private training rates that I now charge. I can empathize with struggling to afford dog training because I was in the same position. I also believe that gatekeeping all information behind high hourly rates can hurt dogs because it leaves guardians with less information and less choices. Unfortunately, there is a vast amount of free online tutorials that will show you how to correct and suppress your dog with harsh methods. If that's what's easily found and what most people see, it's likely going to be what they use. High quality, force-free tutorials are on the rise, but they're still not as prominent yet, especially on YouTube. When I personally converted to force-free training many years ago, I struggled to find tutorials that I could follow and apply at home. So when I started Happy Hounds, I wanted to help change that by creating two completely separate streams private client work, as well as high quality, free or low cost resources. Even though these videos are an exceptional amount of work, I film my free YouTube tutorials with untrained dogs. I believe that that makes them more useful to dog guardians when they can watch a dog genuinely learn the skill or work through the behavior on camera. However, I also know that many people learn better with a complete stepwise program for their dog's specific issues. Something where all the steps and everything that you need to know is laid out in an easy to follow training program. I've been working really hard to create those and I plan on offering them at rates that are gonna make them easily accessible to most people. I've already released a guide for handling prey drive and stopping animal chasing, which I'll link in the video description. In the next while, I'm also going to release complete programs for how I address leash training, leash reactivity, recall, and more. Happy Hands is a business and I do need to make a living as well, but I started this company because I genuinely wanted to make an impact on how dogs are treated and trained. Offering different levels of support is the best way that I know how to do that. Happy training. I'll see you in the next video.